Big news involving Gio is that Matt Crocker came out and said that he and Greg Berhalter have spoken and it's all good. And as soon as he's healthy, he'll be back in the U.S. squad. No problem. Well, nobody dresses uh, better than Gio. All right. He's an expert right now at dressing. We need to get him to get on the field. Uh, as far as the um, the conversation that has now evidently taken place, that's great. Should have happened before, but I'm glad that at least it has happened now and we can kind of move on. It was interesting that Matt Crocker just said, well, as soon as he's healthy, he's back with the team. I, I, I understand that Gio Reyna is uh, and has been and potentially could be a game changer for this team if and when he is healthy and if and well, when he is playing at his best. But the national team is not promised to anyone. And so what really should have been said is if and when Gio Reyna is back playing, he most undoubtedly, uh, undoubtedly will be considered for selection. Just because Gio Reyna is back playing does not mean that he should be back into the national team. And that applies for, for, uh, for any player, okay? If Greg Berhalter feels that it is appropriate in terms of what, Greg, uh, what Gio Reyna is doing on the field, then fine, he'll call him in. Gio Reyna might be playing and he still might not feel it's appropriate for him to get, get called in. But I think that they are just trying to put the best possible spin on all of this. And a lot of it is self-created uh, in terms of this situation, but I'm glad that they have talked. I would have loved to have been a fly on the wall and, you know, seen how Greg approached that one-on-one -on -one type of situation with him and, you know, what he talked about. And it is, listen, um, it's all water under the bridge. Let's start a new clean slate and let's, uh, let's go from here. Is it, you know what? Um, I'm never going to be able to take away what is between us right now. It's always going to be there, but we can both be mature and we can work forward and I can help you and you can help me and we go on or whether it's like, I don't think I did anything wrong. Um, but I'm a coach and uh, I will pick the best players that I feel are going to help me keep my job and have the U.S. win, or maybe a combination of all of those things. Uh, that dynamic would have been fascinating to see, but I, I, you know, I don't think we're ultimately going to uh, learn it, but it's great that it's happened. You like that clip? Well, my State of the Union podcast drops every week. Subscribe now on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you get your podcasts. You like that clip? Well, my State of the Union podcast drops twice a week right here on my very own YouTube page. The only way to stay up to date is to hit that subscribe button down below. Size the day and see you soon.